everyone, I'm Sarah and welcome to this episode of What the Heck Is, a learning with brain cell video series where we tackle the tough questions and sometimes not so tough questions mm -hmm. about running your business. And so today I am joined by my colleague, Kevin. Hi, Kevin. Hello, Sarah. And I asked Kevin to join us today because there's two terms that we hear a lot in business these days. And those terms are artificial intelligence and business intelligence. And a lot of times people use those interchangeably, but they're not the same, right, no, Kevin? No, they're not. So help us out. What the heck is the difference between artificial intelligence and business intelligence? Yeah, good question, good question. So you got this plant and this cup. Mm -hmm. Neither one of them have anything to do with AI or VI. <laughs> so, um, business intelligence looks at the data that your company generates. How many widgets, if you're a factory, how many widgets did you make last week? Or how many sales did you close last week? That, those are examples of business intelligence. Mm -hmm. Think of something you could put into a spreadsheet. And you're all probably using business intelligence and spreadsheets every day. Artificial intelligence, on the other hand, takes lots and lots of data and applies really sophisticated computer algorithms to crunch that data and maybe look for trends that a human might not have spotted or, or maybe new data that a human might not have spotted. So AI and BI play well together, but artificial intelligence does things that we as humans can't. That makes sense. So does AI need BI to work? Yeah, maybe, maybe. Uh, AI, one thing is certain is artificial intelligence needs data. Okay. Now that data doesn't have to be just business intelligence, although it could be. It could be the number of widgets that you made last week. But it can also be things like what's going on in your website. Stuff that's more operational, um, more operational than just business intelligence. Or um, things that your employees are doing, actions they're performing that may not necessarily be business intelligence, mm -hmm. but they can be fed to an AI bot to create that really cool piece of understanding that we missed before. Okay, so give me an example of AI and BI. Mm -hmm. That I, would account, that I would encounter. I was afraid you were going to ask that. Uh, <laughs> in my everyday. Yeah, marketing is actually a really, a, a really common place where you see BI. I mean, sorry, where you see artificial intelligence applied, mm. because the website generates a lot of, a lot of data. A lot of people come to the website, downloading stuff, looking at products, closing sales in the sales department, things like that. So an artificial intelligence bot may look at the website activity and be able to make some predictions that we might not normally make when it, when it correlates that data with sales data. So marketing is a great example, a great place where AI plays a part that we might not expect. Yeah. Lucky for me. Lucky for you. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Thank you for clarifying yeah, sure, that up for sure. us. And um, thank you for joining us. And thank you for being here. And we will see you next time. Bye, everybody. Bye.